Hey, everyone. Guess what we're playing? Yeah! So, it finally came out of early access. Um, and I'm very stoked because the reviews for this game have been awesome. The, um... When I played it in early access, it was pretty good, but they only released a couple of the chapters. So I'm I'm ready. I'm ready. Look, I got my I got my Divinity Original Sin T-shirt. I got it for volunteering with the guys. I may have spoken about that a, for a brief time in one of the games I played. Anyways, I haven't played past the first chapter of this game. So I'm very fresh. I'm very new. I wanted to. I wanted to try to. Um, I wanted to try to keep away as far as possible from anything about the game. So let's go. Story. Single player. Um. What's the difference between these? Explorer mode, classic. Oh right, difficulty. Um. I got some experience, so let's go with classic. Um, you'll need your wits both in and out of combat. Yes, let us do this. I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready. There's so many new characters. I'm gonna try the new characters, and yeah, I, I assume you don't meet them all at the same time. All right, so here's the thing about this game. Okay, let me, I'm gonna move my my portrait out of the way of everything first. I'm gonna have to move it a few times. Um, you could start with a predetermined character or one that you create yourself. So if we if we want to do a preset, no pre or origin, custom dwarf, custom human, custom lizard, custom undead, custom. Ooh. Okay, we got we got some special things that weren't in the in the in the in the game I was playing. Okay, we got dwarf, we got elf, we got human, we got lizard man, which are the standards you played with, and then you have undead, undead dwarf, undead elf, um, undead human, undead lizard. Oh, damn. Origin beast. Okay, so these are the preset characters in the game. You have Beast, you have Fane, you have... You guys remember this guy. I bitched about him so many times back in the day. Um, so let's read about these. I might create my own. Okay, your failed rebellion against the queen nearly destroyed you, so you became a new life on the high seas. Now your old enemy is back. If you don't stop her, no one will. Okay. Fane. You woke up and your world is gone. Last of your kind. You hide behind a charmed mask, searching for the truth about a history that no one knew existed. Ifan. Crusader of Lucian's army. You lost your faith as war claimed other countless incidents. Now you're a lone wolf mercenary. Lone wolf is really difficult to play because you got you don't really work with other people. Um, your stuff is stronger if you're alone. Lose. Um, she's the crazy girl. You're a musician. Performer, star, and host to all manner of disembodied visitors. Now one dark voice has silenced them all and aims to claim your body for itself. So she hears voices in her head. The Red Prince. You are an infamous... You are infamous. A brilliant warrior general exiled from his empire from cavorting with demons. Fallen from grace, you refuse to get up. The throne will be yours once again. Um, Sebo, she doesn't like anybody. She was a slave. A slave no longer. You still bear the living scar your master used to dominate you. He turned you into an assassin, made you hunt your own kin. Now you hunt him. And then we're back with Dorf. Okay, I... When I when I thought I was gonna play this game, I thought I was gonna pick one of the origin um, backgrounds. I think I want to make my own character. All right. So what are our talents? Um, sturdy gives you ten percent maximum vitality, five percent dodging, plus one in sneaking. So decent warrior, decent roguish type. Elf, corpse eater. You eat dead body parts to access the memories of the dead. Ancestor knowledge gives you one of the lore master, creates a magical shield, flesh sacrifice. Sounds I don't know. 
Oh, and these, a petrifying touch. Probably would be good early game. And restores, okay. Human. Human in, 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 ingenious. Gives you two plus initiative bonus, 5% trigger chance. Sounds like a really good thrifty. All right, so your leader type and create the magical dome. Lizard, you have a breath weapon, you have fire resist, you have poison resist, and you get plus one persuasion from spell song. And undead, play dead, you play dead. Dome protection, undead, heal from poison, but regular will damn, oh, this, this might not be good. I guess we get like a poison straight up character. And then Corpse Eater for... Yeah, and so the undead ones are attached with the presets and life. Alright. Um, as much as I really want to play an undead... It's going to be really hard because I have to heal from poison. Pretty much meaning that I have to... Well, poison was really easy to get back in the old game. Like, just downing poison vials. Um, lizard, human, I know uh, in the off chance you get one of every dwarf. I don't think you get a dwarf, though. Well, I guess beast is your dwarf in this game. So one, two, three, four... Five, six. Six characters, so I won't be able to start with them all unless I start another game. Um, I don't know what I want to play. Um, I want to go Cleric. Cleric's always good to start with, but I want... But you'll meet people in the in the game anyways. I love how the lizard people look. They look beautiful. Um, undead would be hard to play. I don't want to go too... Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't want to go too hard for my first game. Um, what did I play last time? I played... I think I played... Oh, yeah. You, were, you didn't really have a choice, so I played humans. Now you have races. I think we go human. I think the thrifty will help me since I'm main character. Um, all right, let's let's get a um, let's go with appearance, skin color, shell, wheat, sable, earth, nutmeg, dune, honey, walnut, shale, turf, caramel, cocoa, ebony, night, flugin, flugin, alabaster. Um, are we going to name one of my characters after my cats? Scuzzies has gotten stuff. French Fry and Ketchup hasn't gotten anybody. And Liamar hasn't gotten anybody yet. I know what kind of personalities I've played my cats. They would be boys, too. So... I want to play a girl! I want my girl cats are girls! Let's just make our own. Alright, um... I feel so boring playing a human, though. Boring! So boring! What's the savior lizards? Aristocrats? Abominations? I've never played an elf before in a game. Well, I played in more Warcraft. I'm too playing. I'm too playing. Let's go human. All right. So human, female. Uh, maybe we can make me. What color is me? Uh, I'm lighter than that. 
earth, sable, wheat. I'm not wheat. Got something yellowish. I think I'm gonna go with that. Okay, face. Ooh. I don't know which one looks like me. Not that. Maybe that. She has the smaller eyes. Oh, but I have to round her face. Well, not that round. Alright, hair style. So, just so you guys can tell, I'm gonna take off this part of my... I shaved my head. I shaved part of my head. You can't really tell when I look because of the headset. So I kinda wanna go with something like that. Ooh, yes! Yes! And I didn't shave my head that much, but do we have another shaved head style? Uh, bald. Yeah, okay. Yes! Alright, higher, higher color. Where's black? Harvestman, Cooper, Jester, Blacksmith? Can we go with darker? Surgeon, Miller, just Monarch, Muller, Weaver's Wire, Plowman, Tailor, Tanner, Carpenter. Alright, uh. I think we're going with Blacksmith. Alright, facial features. None. Okay, we don't have any. Voice. Meet your maker. Prepare yourself. Almost got Greet the Reaper for me. I'll yield to none. Nice try. You're not trying to escape, are you? That sounds like me ish. Okay. Uh, presets. I know we can get characters almost right off the bat in the game, so I'm not worried about presets. I just have to figure out what I have fun playing the most. I usually go with rangers or rogues in games. Um, fighter. What's an inquisitor? Battering ram, bloodsucker, mosquito swarm. Knight. Metamorph. Oh yeah, they added Metam- I remember- Okay, Metamorph when I was playing um, at PAX was a new class. So we have Metamorph, which you can turn people into chickens and shit and bullhorns. And it, it, you're, you're, you, you, you apply um, mutations to yourself. The other one was- I want to see if I- Was it Conjurer? Yeah, Conjurer was the other one. You could summon- um, totems and they correspond to the to whatever you summon them from oh i gotta play one of these uh was there anything else there was cleric battle mage i didn't, i wasn't into battle mage when i played the last game witch wayfarer shadow blade rogue ranger metamorph okay it's gonna be between metamorph and conjurer And they want to build my... Alright, I gotta read more about Conjurer. Um, physical damage. Chicken Claw turns people into chickens. Gore. So, Conjurer sounds like a, like in-your-face mutations person. Um, I mean, uh, Metamorph. Conjurer looks like it's more of your classic... Um, caster and you have people do things for you they're further away I didn't really play I played metamorph more than I played conjurer Because I feel like Conjurer, I mean, I feel like Metamorph has, like, a novelty to it. Because you can turn people into chickens and shit. But... I'm not a really big close... My, I don't really like my mains being close up. I mean, I played a tank once in, in, in WoW. And in Divinity, I just hit shit all the time. Okay, let's go with, um... Let's go with... 
Let's go with Conjurer. I, I'm... Alright, Talents. Pet Pal is always good to have. Um... That's all I get, huh? Okay, Pet Pal. Pet Pal. Tags. Right, you can... Alright, so... You can... Kind of... So, depending on what tags you select for yourself, it may trigger, like, dialogue options in the game. So, what I'm trying to figure out what I want uh, my character, me, to be. Um, I'm not really a scholar type. I'm basing this off of me at this point. Um, I'm not really scholar type. I'm not really noble or mystic. I don't want to have things in my head. Um, Jester. Um, I think I'd be a jester and then Outlaw Jester, I feel. Can you? Okay. Instruments. Oh, and this will, um... This, these, alright. This kind of plays as your, kind of like your theme song. I don't like that. Nope. This, this one. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling this. All right, and my name will be my tag name, Zyla. All right. It's just gonna go through. I really want to be a conjurer. Conjure. Personal elemental matches a surface summoned on. Currently buffed. Once you is a uh, cost is a... Okay. Alright. I'm ready. Let's do this! Cutscenes! I'm I'm pretty excited. It all happened like I knew it would. A single drop of source magic. And like flies to honey, the monsters swarmed. The rebel panicked. The carnage began. The Magisters pointed their fingers at me. Just as I'd planned. I was shackled and collared. And sent to Fort Joy. I'd come here to kill Godwoken. But instead, I became part of their story. <laughs> this is going to be a long game. So yeah, that's the story. You're sent to Fort Joy because you're a sorcerer. And if you've watched any of my last series, you know tons about sorcery. Spelled with you. What the fuck? Where am I? That this wasn't the start of the last game. So it it wasn't a dream after all. Four new journal updates. How do I how do I open my journal? Journal. Um.
Lucian, the divine, champion of the seven gods and savior of everyone, is dead. He sacrificed himself to defeat the forces of Void, leaving his son, Alexander, to provide over the next chapter of Revelon's history. But Lucian's sacrifice did not buy peace. Instead, the years that followed were plagued by the menace of Void Woken. These beasts were drawn to source magic and left death and destruction in their wake. Incapable of wielding the divine powers that his father had at his disposal, Alexander resorted to harsher methods to allow the world to again. A great program to make Kensner Sorrows Fort Joy. I was sent there. Troubled waters. I am bound by a collar. We sorcerers are being transferred to remote joy. Okay. Um. Can I gert? Not a very chatty fellow, are you? All right. So I can highlight things. Can I? Not red, so I can take it, I assume. That's Oh my, this smelling source of strong stuff. Alright. I guess I have to talk to you. Nope. Alright, so tab is to enter combat. Hi. There. Not too tight, I hope. The collar, I mean. Oh, not to worry. Every dog has to get used to its leash. Oh, by the way, this entire game is voice acted. In the meantime, your next stop will be Magister William. All passengers have to be registered in the ship's manifest, and he's the chap in charge of the logs. You'll find him on the other side of this deck, in the officer's quarters. Um... The last thing you remember is hoisting your fight 15 pint, pint. Is this the ram's head zoo? Don't you dare. If you violate the virtue of my carpet, I'll do a good thing worse than put a collar around your neck. Uh huh. Me, 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 me. Index fingers pressed to her lips. She pauses a moment to give you a scrutinizing gander. My word. You do seem a bit befuddled, don't you? Perhaps I was a bit too generous with that sedative. Oh well. I'm sure you'll soon gather your wits. Most likely. Eventually. In the meantime, all you need to know is that we're en route to Fort Joy. A new life awaits. And if you're a particularly good girl, perhaps a cure as well. An end to source. For good. Okay, listen lady. Y that's not gonna happen. We all know already that's not gonna happen. You're gonna toy with me and experiment with me and whatnot. Why have you collared me? Why, for my peace of mind, of course. Why don't you try casting one of those source spells of yours? See what happens. She's a, is a trick. Don't do it. Oh, do go on. I won't hold it against you. Promise. Nope, not gonna do it. Go fuck yourself. I hate you already. My, aren't we a meek little lamb? Perhaps I needn't have collared you at all. Though it does look darling on you. I'm gonna kill you. I don't like you. I'm gonna fucking kill you. What's your name, Siwon? Yeah, we're gonna kill you. So let's just leave it on, shall we? Because, to answer your question, what the collar does is this. It makes you unable to cast source. For your own peace of mind, of course. Yours and the whole world's. I hate you. I already hate you. William, alright. Sorry, I keep on 